Hello. Welcome, and good day to you. Today marks, um, well, the very least, the start of me uh, celebrating the month of fear. Welcome to Haunting Ground, and the start of a new spooky month. Uh, as well as the start of a new feature, uh, hopefully this thing I'm doing here looks so okay. I'm trying out some new uh, video options to, I don't know, make me pop. Am I popping? Well, something's popping. Or popping off. The, the, uh, concept sound, the execution's not ideal, but I would say that this is still probably an improvement over all the garbage that you normally see behind me. So we're going with it for now. Now onto the game. Um... Anything I need to change in here? Per probably not, but best to check now instead of be fucked later. Potentially without the ability to undo it. I have a dedicated button for backstepping. Interesting. Search, throw, kick, dash. Alrighty. Uh... Oh, right. Yeah, I'm always surprised when that actually works. Because this controller is fucked. Yeah, this is probably all fine. Alright. I've been looking forward to playing this for a while. You fuckers can't stop me now. Ha ha, it's my month. some butcher. Serving up slop. Hey, it's Dunk from the Goonies. I love that guy. Oh, look at him. So gentle. Doesn't even want to touch me. It's making me think of somebody else, too. I'm getting like a Frankenstein's monster sort of vibe, but not, not exactly who I'm thinking of. That is a very pretty white silk dress that's going to get absolutely fucked by all the gore and grime I'm going to be crawling through. Oh, whoops, he didn't lock it. Oh, gee, is that even... Is that even a dress, or is that just like a nightgown? Also, it's very, very floaty. Very flowy. As is her hair, for that matter. But hair does do that. Oh, puppy.
Does puppy have a name? Oh, voicing. I guess the guy was grunting and groaning. Oh, okay, no, she is just wearing a towel. All right, yeah, um, or a shower curtain. Yeah, what the what the heck is she wearing? It's like dress material, but it's definitely not strapped to her at all. <sighs> okay, first power up, find pants. Alrighty, we are in control. So let's see, I have. I guess I don't have access to full controls yet because I am just wearing rags. Can't crouch, can't backstep. I can't kick. Gee, I sure hope my buttons are at... No, they. I was able to navigate the menu, and the control stick is working at the very least. They should work. Yeah, I can dash. Alrighty. I'll just wander around for now. Uh, our interactable is gonna show me an icon. No. No, they are not. Where am I? Uh, looks to me like you're in the stables? Crow. Book it. No help. An urn. Also no help. Hmm, good old fixed camera perspective. This is gonna fuck with me, I'm sure. And not in the way that's intended, no siree. Very pretty garden. Stairs into a building. I wanna see what else is outside first. Flower pot. Some little hole here. There's a hole here, but it's far too small for me. Bitch! Crouching was almost enough to get through that hole. But you're not wearing real clothes, so I understand. This door is being blocked by that wooden box. There's gotta be something I can do. Hmm, lots of cages over here. And is there anything on that stump? It almost looks like somebody's carved into it. Guess not. No, no interactable cage, no. Well, these are presumably something. Empty cages litter the area. Maybe this was some kind of kennel for keeping animals. That door works. What did I find? Did I obtain actual chamomile or did I get one of those like silk screen or knit? Uh, shoot, what are those called? Needlework, like, like the, the needlework things. Maybe I can find out. Pause. Okay, there's my menu button. Hmm. Uh, okay, yeah, I guess that's just a style then. Chamomile, type of herb. Completely restores lost stamina. Where am I? I was in a car with my parents. And I... It's no good. Everything seems so fuzzy. Got very little to go on. Oh, also, where am I keeping that chamomile? 
Probably just in my hand for now, but th that won't last me forever. <laughs> this door has been boarded up. So I can't go around? Guess not. Got a very, very small corner to hide in. Such a large door. What could be on the other side? I don't know. Why don't you open it and find out? Uh, unless that latch is locked in some manner. Oh, jeez. Not the perspective I was expecting. Well, this is a very pretty mansion. Very, very large. It's bolted from the other side. I'm not going to be able to open this. see the light flicker from the candles inside, but it's too dark to see anything else. A bunch of pots here. Yep. And that presumably means that those don't open, or at least I can't open them yet. Oh, jeez, is this game going to have any loading zones? Oh, I think I saw something. I can't just walk around all day holding these sheets around me. Call me old-fashioned, but I would prefer a normal set of clothes to these bed sheets. Oh, bed sheet. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. Oh, that wasn't a person walking around. That's me in a mirror or the window. I guess that's just what she says when I try to interact with nothing. Or maybe I can't interact with it and I'm a little preoccupied with thoughts of, I'm cold. <coughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but the master of the mansion looks an awful lot like that dude from, uh, Amnesia. <laughs> Man, you're quiet. Thank you. Oh, I didn't know it's a scar on your back. Wait, don't go. Um, excuse me, but where are we? And how did I get here? Who are you talking to?
NPCs randomly showing up and disappearing just as quickly. Classic art, classic horror RPG. Or just horror, survival horror. I want, I want clothes, please. There we go. There is a change of clothes. It made has apparently laid out. Was that wait? Was she a maid? I, I couldn't get a good grip of what kind of outfit that was. Uh, yeah, sure. Good old pervy peeping holes. What is that mark on her back? Is it just, like, was she just resting against something, or does she actually have a scar there? It's too blurry, I can't make it out. Ah, uh, that is a... Uh, somebody has tastes for backless dresses and short skirts. Boy, what's going on now? That worked. But now what should I do? If I could just find a map at this place, then I could get my bearings. Do... Do old-timey mansions usually have a map? You are now able to perform the following actions. Kick. To smash certain background objects or to stun enemies. Uh, throw or set some objects. After equipping them. Or place them down on the ground. I can now crouch. Uh, to crouch down in the shadows to make it harder for enemies to find you. Yeah, sure. Quickly jump backward to avoid the enemy's attack. Use this maneuver too much and your stamina will decrease. Okay. Some background objects can be moved by pushing or... Yeah. In the direction of the object you want to move. After running for a few seconds, press the square button to tackle. Ah! I see, uh, I see I'm a quarterback. If you were able to hit the enemy with this move, you can shove them out of your way, but you will lose a large amount of stamina in the process. I'm running, and tackle, please. There we go. Where is my stamina? Is it visible? No. I guess she is one of the maids working here. She's so beautiful. Almost too beautiful. It almost seems unnatural. No one could be that beautiful! She's she's creating a an un, unattainable goal of beauty. An unattainable standard of beauty. Feels almost like it was custom tailored to fit me. It really clings to my shape quite nicely. Although it feels a little tight in the chest area. Yeah, yeah, I guess, uh... I guess they didn't have your size... Wait. I guess they didn't have your size correct, right? Was that? Are those? Hmm. Is that, is that what I think it is? Jiggle. 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 Yep. PS2 game with some jiggle physics. Real, real important. They really had to make sure that they had that. I wonder whose portrait this is. Some dick. A chest used to store clothes. Nothing. Nah. Nada. Freshly starched and pressed sheets and bed covers now line the bed. Ooh, I find something. Oh, come on, Fiona. It's not like you're going to find the boogeyman under there. Oh, can I not crawl? 
No, oh, crouching's all I get. The sun is starting to set, and with it will come night. The fire burns, emitting a red glow. The room is heated to a comfortable temperature. What a powerful piece of art. The eyes really feel like they're peering deep into one's soul. He's peering at something, all right. The clock catches up moments in time. Yes, I will save. Oh, that was just loading? Okay, well, the actual save was pretty quick. There's a pair of scales lying here. It looks like their purpose is more one of decoration than that of actually weighing things, which is to say that I will not be using that function later in the game? Or is that... Or are you just lying to me? Yeah, wow, they, um... Yep. Really, really just put that in there. I hope this TV works. Well, it works, but it ain't got no signal. A bird cage. Right now, there is nothing in it. I should cover as much of this castle as I can while there's still some light left. There's an antique doll lying here. The man pictured here has a noble air about him. Does it have something to do with his foppish chapeau? I wonder how long ago this portrait was painted. Hmm. Well, further into the building, probably. Side. Hmm. What's this I see? Is this blood? Uh oh. Uh oh, my sanity. Ah. I have a very weak constitution. It's causing me to black out for just a second. The door is locked from the other side. Hmm, here's a nice long hallway with a good view. As a book stands stalwart. It looks quite old. Perhaps it's an antique? Old scholarly masterpieces fill up the shelves. It's almost as if someone has been doing some research here. Tends to be what studies are for. Not to state the obvious, but this is clearly the castle study. In case you didn't catch that a second ago. Lavender. What are you good for? Slowly reduces panic. Ah, okay. Lavender smells nice, and chamomile, I guess, is invigorating. 
Yeah, that checks. Is, it, is nothing? There we go. There's something scribbled on the board. Luminescence are tiny creatures that respond to the ethereal energies given off by Azoth. They can be used to help track down nearby Azoth. However, several precautions must be taken while handling them. 1. When luminescents come into direct contact with an Azoth-infused item or being, they send forth a small charge which shocks the carrier. Okay. The higher the concentration of Azoth in said carrier, the greater and more powerful the shock. 2. Luminescence's lifespan is dramatically decreased whenever they come into a direct contact with the open air. This time differs from specimen to specimen, but is never much longer than a few minutes. Luminescence? Azoth? No clue what as any of this means. What else is on this desk? Oh, this goes way beyond something you would learn at the college level. Yep. Another little corner where I can maybe hide. It's not very deep. The desk is locked. Apparently, I can only access this left one. Hey, big man. Dolly. Very large uh, irises. Yeah, I should probably get away from that. Whoop, ah, that way. Oh no. What should I do? If I don't do something, that thing will get me. Uh, press the circle button when near closets or beds to hide and escape enemies that are pursuing you. While hiding, Fiona's stamina covers at an accelerated rate, and her panic decreases at an increased speed. Ah, good. Also, press the circle button once while hiding to exit the evasion point at any time. So there is uh, exploration mode and fighting mode. Fight or flight mode, I guess. If you approach a possible evasion point while being pursued by an enemy, the words, wait a second, what's that, will be displayed. This is a hint. However, be warned that if you repeatedly hide in the same location over and over again, the enemy will soon catch wind of your hiding spot. Yeah, I'm gonna get under there for now. I uh, can't look around, so I guess I just have to wait for him. Also, I tried to close that door behind me, but I feel like it. I'm, I, I messed up and it just did it by itself. And off he goes. Are you... are you gonna leave? Well, he 
and get mad first. That's right, back from once you came. Coast clear. Wow, that is uh, more than I would have expected the game to give me. Sure hope he isn't just around the corner. Oh, he totally is. Fantastic. But the coast was clear. He's a bunny. Well, can I go over there? He's a coming. He's a uh, he's really coming. Oh, I thought this might have been like a scripted event, but this might just be what happens when I'm attempting to hide somewhere. Well, that's a nice feature that makes sure that I don't get surprised by the the, the enemy because I fucked up. Come in there. Not that I imagine being a lot for him to break out. Yeah, because he can certainly use doors. Coast will be clear soon, right? No, no more music. Yeah, we're back to, uh, creepy exploration music. Alrighty. I found nothing. Well, backtracking did get me one thing at the very least. Get to clear this stuff. Huh? What's this? Magnesia. Created by polishing extracted magnesium ore. This item is used by setting it on the ground. An enemy runs over this magnesia, it will explode and do damage to them. Oh my god. So I, I, I literally just have like a, <laughs> a small explosive in my hand. Cool. That's, uh, that's dangerous. Where are all those pots? There's like three of them here somewhere. Just around this corner? Yeah, there you are. Bam! Bam! Huh? What's this? Medallion. Metal used during the alchemic refining process. Your basic run-of-the-mill alchemic component. It's a generic alchemy bullshit. You know. You know the one. I wonder what kind of room is on the other side. Mm, you can try opening it. 
It doesn't look like that's going to happen, though. You're not in here waiting for me, are you? No. Alright, we'll continue going over here. Hopefully he's cleared out. Wait, did he close that door? Oh no, that that door was locked. This door is uh still open. A bisque doll. Debilitas's favorite plaything. It is coated with caked on dirt and gives off quite the pungent odor. That's not dirt. Wait, equip it. Oh, I can probably distract him with it. Yeah, alrighty. Yeah. Gross. Something. Something leaked all over that. Let's run down this whole corner. A woman with wings protruding from her back. An angel, perhaps? Yes, thank you for the description. That is, uh... Sorry, my, do I have the wrong glasses on? I, mean, I don't feel like my prescription is up to snuff here. It is completely ruined. What could have happened here? Um, that's a chandelier. Is this a bird cage? It looks like the remaining husk of a bird in the cage. Yeah, someone forgot about this room a long time ago. So we must be living in a pretty modern era for her not to recognize a typewriter. Uh, I got ten reels of something here. I'm not gonna fuck around with that until I have a clue what I'm supposed to do with it. Got a couple of names I can use. None of them useful. Probably. What a strange mark. There's something about it that makes me feel uncomfortable. Hmm. A huge doll made of earth blocks the door. There is a slot-shaped hole in its chest. This is that alchemy shit, eh? Huh? What this? There is some kind of file here. Oh, parchment. A deciphering of the Book of Origins, Seferu Yitera, has uncovered the process for creating life from Earth's soil. This golem needs not nourishment nor sleep, making this earthen guardian the ultimate safekeeper of our deepest alchemic secrets and knowledge. I dub this creature Emeth. Hmm. That probably means something. What kind of equipment is this? It looks old, but someone has taken painstakingly good care of it. Uh. 
I got nothing. Anything on this little shelf here? Oh man, I can interact with so many things in the other room. Now I got nothing. Such tremendous heat. With heat like this, I'm sure it's used for refining. But refining what into what? Okay, well, found some stuff. Guess I'll go downstairs. Also, did I find any hiding places over there? Uh. No, not really. All, I, all I've got right now is that bed. A painting. Several people appear to be clasping their hands in prayer. It seems like this and the painting hanging next to it make up a set of twin paintings. Yeah, those are nice. I like works of art in several parts. Like, um... Frescoes. Frescoes are good for that. They make you make a whole room an entire artwork. You just keep drawing me further and further in with that light. Where's it coming from? Hmm. Antimony power. Uh, looks like another equipable item. Yes, that's what that icon means. A hardened clump of antimony power. Throw it, and it explodes on... God, so many explosives here. Its attack power is weak, but it can stun enemies for a short period of time. Cool. So use this on an enemy that I... Uh, I guess want to aggress through, and then this is good for somebody who's chasing me. Both in cases where I guess I can't or don't have room to tackle someone? Bucket. Give bu give bucket. It's the handle. Open. Open whatever dead is. No. Nope. Corner for hiding. Maybe. I don't know how effective it'd be. The door is locked from the other side. Hmm. Either I'm supposed to do something at this point, or I could crawl into that hole I saw earlier. See if she was just lying about that. I'm getting the distinct feeling at this point that all the enemies are just gonna appear at set intervals, and I'm in no rush to get anything done. Nice! Sense of security there. Oi? Oi? What do you mean, too small? Perfectly fit to go in there. I can't. My I I just can't. My chest is my, too big, too hefty. Can't can't fit. My honker badonkers.
Okay, yeah, there's there's a little bit of a weird running animation there. Woo! Moonwalking! Leave it to me to turn a horror game into a joke. Okay, uh... Oh, am I actually... Oh, yeah, I'm uh, losing stamina by running around all, all, all day long. Okay, well... Ah, frick. I, I, like, kicked the wall really hard just before the stream started, and now I, now I got a, a sore toe. It's giving me those warm, fuzzy feelings. Like, like a wart. It's a plate-pressing machine. Oh, okay. You didn't mention that last time. And it was in orange, like a certain golem's name. Emeth. It's not gonna bite. You've obtained the Emeth plate key. Ah, special item. A thin metallic plate with letters carved into it. And I figured that medallion was going to be some sort of key item, but it looks like it's treasure or a component for... Mm. I don't know, maybe I can craft more bombs. Okay, Emeth. Let's, uh... Let's wake you up. Ah! sure don't get a lot for one plate. Whatever mechanism moved it seems to have run its course. I think it's here to stay. Quit Blair Witching, Emmett! Tell where I am. Man, that's a dark corner. It would be good for hiding if I didn't have such a crazy uh, highlight on me. Okay, looks like I'm outside again. And I've got the choice of a precarious jump or a. Well, it looks like it's in a fine condition. Ladder. And something shiny on a column. Don't look up. Yeah, how am I gonna reach that? Can I can I move the ladder? I certainly, I don't, I don't think I have the jumps for that. Ooh, more pots. More magnesia. Probably gonna get into a fight soon then. Unless, I wonder if a explosion would set off the... or er, uh, knock the thing down. Uh, this looks like an old will or something. The opening has been sealed up with a wooden board. And someone's pushed that bench aside. No, 
nothing in that corner. Okay. Door. I'll need to find a key if I'm going to get through this door. Man, I really appreciate how uh, how this game is uh, loading in between areas. Unless it has just loaded this entire area, in which case they're, they're also very impressive. The less door transition cutscenes, the better. Hey, look, a little, little hidey corner. Which I'm going to have to use, like, right now. In addition to evasion points, you can avoid enemies by pressing... The crouch button near shadow. Also, if an enemy is nearby while you are crouching, the camera will change to a first person perspective. I saw that! So you can watch the enemy as they search around. Utilize this ability if the enemy is chasing and you happen upon a nearby shadow. <sighs> Except the shadows are very lightly rendered in the environment, so... I'm really going to have to keep my peepers open. Am I using it now, or am I going to use it in just, like, a split second here? The gate is closed. There's no way through. I'm going to have to find another way. Hey, a key. W uh, w w is that perspective? No, I don't think so. This harp is so large and bulky. It's hard to imagine people actually playing these things. Yeah, that's a... Damn, that's a big harp. Someone's nearby. Playing the piano. Oh. The bookshelf of fine design has a rather sturdy look to it. Sounds like Oh, I can I can push it. Which looks like I could push it over on someone. A lot of information right before your fingertips. A lot of the books seem to be on the subject of music, as is... Yeah? Maybe they wouldn't mind if I took a few of these books. Nah, I'm sure they would just weigh me down. Huh? What's this? More chamomile. And some recorders and trumpets. I see there's somebody sitting in that chair getting ready to jump scare me when I grab that key. Hey. Hey, I see you. Don't think just because you put a sheet over your head you're suddenly invisible. What are you, six? Are you six? Is this, does this work as a hiding spot? Can I, can I, can I legitimately hide here? I can't see me. If I can't see you, you can't see me. Or if I can't see me, no one can see me, I guess. Hmm. Alrighty. Huh? What this? I can see the lower half of that torso. I don't think it should. Pretty grody.
Okay, yeah, and this guy was putting out the vibes and delivering fully on them. He is super pervy. What is this thing? It is really giving me the creeps. How would anyone in their right mind put something like this here? To keep you company during the time. Garden key. Your average run-of-the-mill key. This key gives you entry to the inside of the castle through the garden. Which was that last room I came across, I think? So that's a pretty dark corner. I'm, I might be able to hide here, but I don't exactly have any cover. I don't know if that'll be enough. Just, like, I've seen a lot of that so far. Okay, those are my footsteps. Hmm. The... Asms? Am... Am... Ghosts. Ghosts. They're... Or luminescent. Uh, are tiny creatures that feverishly pursue Fiona once that... Uh... Tiny creatures that feverishly pursue Persona once that have caught wind of her. So one and done is how that reads. When Illuminescent makes contact with Fiona, it not only puts her in a state of panic, but also ruptures, producing a sound which attracts unwanted attention of nearby enemies. Cool, they're alarms. Luminescence do fade over time, but the most effective way to rid of yourself of these troublesome creatures is to reach a neighboring area and close the door. Doing this cuts off Luminescence sensing ability and stops them dead in their tracks. Okay. Go away, go away. Go away, sir. I do not want to deal with you. Goodbye. Oh, I need to go that way. Hmm. Ah! That unf unfair. Where'd you come from? Okay, well. I guess that happened. Do I have any sort of... Nah. That don't look like it. I just kind of... Fucked up my vision temporarily. Yee! Not again! You coming through? Yes. Okay. And give him a little, a little deaky. Give him a little deek. <laughs> nice little dodgy noise. Well, at least they're slow, but. Yeah, annoying. Go away. Oh, good. That door closing is rather intuitive. Let's try this again. Oh, I guess it's already open. Why in the world is there a chair here? This is just a normal chair, right? You look like you're about to sit in it. Well, then almost certainly not.
Clocks are good choices for a uh, save point. Mm -hmm. Something that makes noise. Hmm. What? There's no knob. Now what do I do? It's the men's room? Presumably it is revolving door. Wait, there is a hook here. Maybe if I attach something to it, I could use that in place of a doorknob. I will design this damn mansion. The design and type are identical to the previous chair. They are probably from the same set. The chair itself looks to be of a standard design. I. Cool. So what? I have found the kitchen. Looks like meat is being served. It appears they still haven't finished preparing it. What I find this time? Chicken jerky, yum! That's a new icon. Chicken that has been slowly deep smoked over time. Restores a small amount of a dog's stamina. <gasps> dog item? Nothing in the pot. The sink looks rusted in several spots. A thick reddish black discoloration cakes the surface. That's blood, baby. Varied ornate. Varied ornate high class china lines the shelf. You know, I should probably get in the habit of opening doors and then doing a quick back pedal in case someone or something is waiting for me. Ooh. Hiding spot? Yes. Why are there so many candlesticks on this table? It's dark? We're holding the ants? To get rid of the ghosts? Cracked plate key. Oops. Not the button I want to hit. Also not the button. Oh my god. No, oh, my controls. I'm forgetting. Metallic plate that has been broken in half. The letters ST are carved into the plate. And that would... Uh, makes me think that there's probably two or three more characters to that. Can't think of any words that would fit that role so far. A large tapestry is suspended here. I wonder if this is an embroidery of one of the castle's many crests. What's with the discoloration of this brick? Looks like a tile fell off the wall. And yeah, nothing regarding that fireplace. Oh, where does this connect to? The long hallway? Are we good? Am I in the clear? I don't, I don't think I hear nothing.
I'm at the bottom of the stairs. Okay. Uh, that might be useful. There, at least I can run a full circuit of this place now. Don't worry about getting cornered. There are notes on that post. Probably not important. This plywood panel door is blocking my path, but it could be easily broken through. All right, you heard the girl. Hut one, hut two, hike. Yeah! Didn't think that would actually work. <laughs> Damn, girl. What the? It's just a, just a red flower. Just a pig's head covered in mushrooms. Maybe. Should probably get rid of that. Castle sketch. Oh my god, a map. And a spider. A hand-drawn sketch of the belly castle. A section of the rooms in the basement have been colored in red. Consumed map. Ah, and it even shows me where I am. Not necessary, but appreciated. So, let's see. Stairs, I got a long hallway. And a red spot. Okay. So, green denotes what level I'm on. And there's something special about red areas. Uh, with that finality, it kind of looks like a boss arena. And it shows me which doors I've attempted to go through, a la Silent Hill. Hmm. Okay. Alright. Hello, little spider. Keep on keeping on. Ooh. Yellow. More chicken jerky. And some meds. Not for me. Table I can maybe hide under. So I'm sure I'm gonna get cornered here. Back off, dude. Well, he not too bright. Let me use that to my advantage. Careful now. Oh shoot, she she just like me, she stubborn toe too. Finally, someone who shares my pain. <laughs> I 
double take. Yeah, better keep moving. Uh, who now? Bye, Debilitas. I am Ricardo, Keeper of the Castle. So sorry to hear about your accident. Your parents. Master Ugo and Mistress Ayla are both deceased. You, Miss Diana, are the sole surviving heir of Bellina. His name was Ugo? Are you in pain, Miss? Will you be alright? We've had a long day. Please, rest upstairs. That wasn't an invitation. How could my father be so stupid as to drive into an entire pile of logs? And at like a hundred kilometers an hour, too. Did I hear? A good boy. <gasps> oh no. Save him. Doggy. Bork, bork, I'm coming. It's only nighttime now, all the bugs are out. Don't worry, I'm coming. I got you. Unforgivable. A wire is bound to the poor animal. It is digging deeply into the dog's neck. Yeah, yeah, that's uh. No, please come back. Come. I 
can't believe there are people out there that would do this to a poor, helpless animal. <sighs> it's amazing what sorts of cruelty they'll perform on animals these days. And that man, so big and freaky. I don't know, he was a pretty soft-looking boy. I just want to get out of this nightmare as soon as I can. There's a thick wire encircling the trunk of the tree. And the remains of the collar? The wire looks like it got snagged on something. So many wounds. So much blood. You poor thing. With all these wounds, it's no wonder you were howling in pain. It was more like a weak wince. Could hardly hear him. Okay, well, let's see here. Um, that area seems to be closed off, so I have to access it through that gate over there if a box is blocking it. Can I not just open this gate? The hinge is rusted solid. Try as I may, I can't open this door. Someone will just have to open it for me. Or... Hurrah! No, not, not quite. I almost had it. Yeah, I guess not. Cool. Not a lot I can do in this chicken coop. Oh, you know what? Dog. Dog probably whole. Well, now I need dog. Did he go this way? Oh, wait. I just want to put the terrible things I saw back there behind me. I'm not going back. Yeah, fair. Fair. It's a fine decision. Good, new door. What the frick is that? Looks like there is something up there. Yes, but what? Whoop. Yeah, okay, maybe not the best idea. It's going to be too hard for me to get up there. The door is locked from the other side. Shiny, shiny. Another medallion. And do all the alchemy.
I didn't really notice before, but why? Why? What? 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 Uh, what? All the chokers, man. Gotta be putting girls in chokers all the time. You had the choice. You didn't have to put that on. But it completes the outfit. Did I? No, I didn't really get anything from doing any of that. I need dog. I need dog. I need a brave, strong, good boy. Hey, that's my bed. Hi, buddy. Hi. Oh, no, he's in monster mode. Oh, don't touch me. I'll scream. doing are your shoes tied together what what are you doing <laughs> you just scratching your balls in front of me Push up on the right analog stick to command the dog to attack. Ah! <laughs> I ain't having any of that. Should really be checking back here periodically to make sure I'm still visible. I haven't exactly done a lot of bug testing on this camera. Puppy. What's your name? Tui. Didn't keep the collar. Huey has befriended you. Give him various commands with the right analog stick. Uh, normal mode, search the surrounding area, and in battle mode, attack. While biting enemy, press up to urge Huey on, increasing the amount of time he bites an enemy. Ah, okay. Uh, call Huey to your side. Press down to stop Huey from biting. If Huey begins to act disobediently, scold him for his actions. This will have an effect on how Huey responds to you. Probably poorly? Praise! If Huey is especially respondent to a command or does something that is praiseworthy, then praise his actions. This will have an effect on how Huey responds to you. Also, praise Huey while nearby and he will slightly regain some stamina. Uh... That's... Right stick click command Huey to sit and stay or order Huey to wait this increases his attack power temporarily huh. sometimes depending on the circumstances Huey may ignore some commands in those instances try approaching Huey and reissuing a command while you were standing next to him if time to write the scold command can also be effective in these situations dog Good boy, Huey. Huey. 
Good boy. It's official. We have, we have pet the dog action. Come here. Girl with dog returns. It's my favorite ship. Oh, ac wait, no, scratch that. Go, boy, go. There's a hole here, but it's far too small for me. What's up, boy? Come on. Come on. Yeah. Gonna, gonna go look in that hole for me? Oh, good boy. Good boy. Push the box. It's a good dog. Good boy. Who's a good boy? Give your dog plenty of praise and he shall reward you for all your days. There's something on the ground here? It's like a plaque. Uh. Beep, Jarky. Beef that has been slowly smoked over time completely restores a dog's lost stamina and makes them happy. I guess it's is a way to make up for loss of morale from scolding too much. Come on, boy. Ooh, what that? A ball. This handy ball can be used for playing simple games with canine companions. Oh my god! I can play fetch with Huey. Come on. Come over here. There he is. Go get the ball. Good boy. Right. I can't change the camera. But I'll, I'll give him praise anyway. Now, where'd that ball go? Ball. Ball. No. No, the ball. Go, Huey. So you have to pick it up for me? No, I fucked up. I can't play fetch anymore. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, boy. Is this also to train him how to fight? Go, Huey. Go, Huey. Oh, he dropped something. Viola medallion. Good boy. Who's a good boy? Is there any negative to praising the dog? I guess it might uh, Go, instill in him some uh, bad habits. If I just praise him for everything. Push door, boy. Mm, a 
maybe if I... Wabam! No. Okay, well, that's fine. Let's go. Oh, right. I should also probably look at the medallion. Metal used during the alchemical refining process. Used to create dog-based items. Okay. Uh, sort. So I got regular medallions and dog medallions. What is using a medallion? I put it in that weird purple pot? Oh, what's wrong? Did you get lost? I'm right here. What's wrong, boy? You're okay. Let's go. You can help me with this, too. Go, Huey. Get it. Get whatever the hell that thing is. Broken marionette. Its strings have been cut in various places, rendering the puppet unusable. But it looks like something I could hang on a wall. Thank you very much. Now, where was that hallway? Um, it's not going to be any further this way, I guess. I was trying to think of what's faster. Eh. I'll just go a straight path. God, this is really making me miss uh, Rule of Rose. Female survival horror protagonist with dog is really, really good concept. I very much appreciate it. Uh, yeah, just make sure. Let's see here. Uh... We go downstairs. Yeah, downstairs would be faster. Oops. That door is already open. Looked closed to me. Come on, boy. Come on. Where, where, where'd you go? Huey. Huey, where'd, 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 where'd you go, boy? There he is. Huey. That's, uh, not quite the right way. Come on. Hey. Look. 
Come along. There we go. Okay, so every once in a while he's just gonna stop paying attention to me. <coughs> I'll give him plenty of praise and scold him when he's uh, acting out of sorts. You'll have yourself a good dog. This is traditionally what maids wear. She looks busy preparing dinner. Perhaps this isn't the best time to strike up a conversation. That's fine, I got places to go. Come on. Uh, back this way. Wait, did I go down that corner there? I don't think I did. It's not very long. Nope, not long at all. But. But. Ah, the other half of that plate key. A metallic plate that has been broken in half. The letters RE are carved into the plate. So, I'm going to have to make up rest. What could this be used for? There appears to be a slot of sorts. Could this be some kind of lock? Darn! The door's locked! Now how am I going to get this open? The wall looks weak here. Maybe if I hit it hard enough I can break through it. Whoa! Oops. Start charging too soon. Whoa! Not quite. Whoa! I guess I need more distance. Ah, bugs! Eh, uh, my, my sanity. No bugs. Uh, I'm just going to leave that alone. And instead, use you. Hmm. Maybe I should save. Well, that is an interest. No, don't kick the clock. I need that. Yep, very creepy puppet room. Uh oh. What's up? Something's got him spooked. Oops. Is someone just trying to scare me? This place is so freakish. I just want to get out of this room as quickly as possible. A very strange taste in decor. It's closed. I wonder if there isn't a way for me to raise this. Do I need to? There appears to just be a uh, spot here I can walk through. Although it is over a very odd carpet and wall of eyes. I do not trust. Concept of walking through that. Let's uh, let's go see if those bugs have cleared out first. Yep. 
Something shiny. Refined antimony. This was used against luminescence. Hardened clump of antimony powder. Used to throw it at enemies. Explode an impact, electrifying the enemy. More potent than standard antimony powder. Oh, no, I just already had one of these. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of uh, attack. To oh, wait, I still have ball. I didn't lose it. Where'd you go, Huey? Hey. Hey, Huey. Come on. Whew. Go get the ball. Did you, did you get it? Let's try that again. Uh, or wait, where's the where's the ball? Get the ball. Go, Huey. Get the ball. It's right there. Oh, well, that's okay. Hey! Hey, look at that! What's that noise? I swear I just heard something. Huey, come here! Come on. Sit. Yeah, just, you just sit right there. Man, I don't know how I always manage to stumble into puzzles like this. So this was probably going to kill me if I ran into it. It's a breaker box. Don't know what that did, but... Presumably something good. There's an oddly placed chair here as well. This place continues to weird me out. It's, it's more so the lighting over the chair, like, I don't know, does this, does this belong to some historical figure or something? Is it a family heirloom? Oh good, dog made his way here. Call right now, and I'll pick up the phone for you. Something shiny on the other side of the room. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, something going on. Oh, look, some magnesia. Ah! Hey, that's not fair. I was picking up an item. Whoop. Oh, 
Well, I can walk here through here now. Oh, he's quick. Oh, whoopsie. Ow. Let me go. Oh no. What you doing? See me? Yeah, he saw me. the bed. No, leave the dog alone! I would not be standing there, dog. Did he... Did he manage to not give me away? Are you coming? Get out of it! Stop it! Leave the dog alone! Also, what were you cooking? There's something gross going on in that pot. How is our boy doing, I wonder? Sure wish I had a system to look at that. I have to get away, but where to? This machine is used to engrave letters into these plate things. The only question is, why build a machine for the sole purpose? What do the plates do? Judging by the fact that this hook is here, there's probably something hanging here. But what? My parents are dead? It has to be a lie. Maybe it's all just a dream. Or maybe I am just in shock or something. That has to be it. It just has to be. Poor Pooch. You really look hurt. I hope you'll be alright. Hopefully you have enough strength to run away if someone comes after us. This hardly looks sturdy enough to stand on. I'm not a big girl, but it will take someone, or rather something, lighter than me to climb up here. I'm just big boned! I just have to find a way out of here. I just want to get out. But since the gates appear to be locked, I only have one other option. I need to find a different way out. Huey! Oh, thank goodness. I'm not alone with you by my side. I'm not alone anymore. Let's get out of this place. The both of us. No thanks. I'd rather just keep my distance. And come to think of it, what was that thing she was mixing? Sort of like angel hair pasta. Mmm, pasta. Azoth. I've never even heard of it before. But it looks like someone is trying to help me out of this nightmare. Well, I think Huey and I both took two... Actually, no, he took three hits. Maybe I should give him uh, a little something. A little something-something. 
for trying to protect me. You have some jerky, boy. There you go. Yum, yum. Good boy. Okay. Now it's, um... Kind of want to go back upstairs to print a rest plate. But, uh, what's his name? He's going to be over here, isn't he? going on over here? We'll be slapping. this. Where is he? Where is the old Ricardo, not an ally to women. Man, he's just going a whole hog on her. I won't let him touch her. Do you hear me, old man? The Azov is mine. I need to read that note on the Azov again. <laughs> oh no, my sanity. Ooh, it's a, that's a that's a big suffer. Oh jeez, okay, I've I've lost complete control. Gotta run. Uh, lavender was good for that. Yeah, I should suck on some lavender. There we go. Oh, no, is he here? Yeah. Sneaky dicky. Medal. Can I just like throw the doll at him and he'll go away? Seems to be running with purpose. I 
guess I can't close that door anymore. No, leave the dog alone. Aha, you missed. Also, do you, you if you want this doll so bad, just fuck take it. I gave you your dolly! Ugh, weird claustrophobic hallway. And he come. Dog, you really gotta stop coming around while he's here. That's right, just piss off. I'll give him a sec to clear out. Are you gonna beat on the dog? Just cause you can. Go away. Okay, All righty, should be safe now. There's a doll slumped in the chair. Perhaps this is the nursery. Oh, God. Uh, definitely thought that was a perspective thing. That is a huge cage. Why is there a doll in a cage? Maybe someone is just trying to keep one of their valuables under lock and key. And again, maybe not. Yeah, everything in this room is really huge for a nursery. It's a child's rocking horse. Maybe, maybe this is, uh, what's his name's room? What you got in your room, big guy? Another medallion. Wish I know what to do with these damn things. It's a crib for a small child. The sheets have become discolored from lack of use. I guess the maid has intended to this room in a long time. It's a box, but I can't open it. And a large collection of dolls. Don't tell me this is going to be like the last one. There's a slot here. Okay. Oh, puppy. Thank you. Good boy. I'm giving you praise in a while. Good boy. What'd you find? 
Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to pick it up. I'm looking at the rocking horse instead. <clears throat> More antimony. I should maybe actually use some of these. And immediately next to the uh, nursery is a military exhibit. This spear decoration serves as an obvious conversation piece. Hard to believe people used to swing these things around. I don't like that suit of armor. I guess this room serves as a museum of sorts. What the fuck is with this hole? Creaks and pops crackle out of the dubious looking hole. Everything about the hole screams, don't go in. Eh, not just yet. I'm, I'm busy looking around. What's up with this exhibit? Agnes Die. Looks like that's the title of this diorama. That looks like I might fall down. Can I? Yep. Eh, shit. Oh, where am I now? Oh, hello again. Oh god, he just jumped. Uh, do, I have uh, time for this! Yeah, understandable. Have a good day. That's weird. Stamina, do I have stamina item? Sure, I'll use some now. is when it comes to ladders. You know, I should probably get uh, Huey to, to bite him so I can steal the keys off his waist. Probably gonna need those. It'd probably be really inconvenient for him.
Where the hell am I? What, what, what is this? Looks like it pivots at the base. Rotate by pressing right or left. Oh, I'm in... Oh, okay, I'm just one level up. Not sure if I care for your decor. Tinkering out a few chords may soothe my nerves a bit, but now is hardly the time or place to be practicing my piano skills. Yeah. More lavender. Hey, cool, I'm here again. Maybe I can all go actually print that thing now. Man, I got so turned upside down. What's going on in here now? I hear a squeaky. Nope, still a dead bird. Hey, I'm busy. Rest. All right, somebody just lock me in here. Using the medallion here. Nope. I don't know what I use this for or on. Good boy. Why do the stairs stop halfway? That is a very good question. Wish I had an answer. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a shot. Let's see if I can knock this loose. Nope! Well, that was a waste. Fantastic. go through that door? Yes. Yes, I did. Yeah, nothing else in here. If he attacks me, I got a good way to defend myself.
based off of where I found that plate... Hey, look at that. It worked. Is this, a, is this a safe room? Is this where I go to rest? Oh, it's a restroom. I just unlocked the restroom. More chamomile. Some pretty flowers to calm my nerves. A bath. A hiding spot bath. Broken mirror. I wonder if this water is drinkable. State is restored. Search a recovery point to calm Fiona from state of panic and completely restore stamina. However, please note that recovery points cannot be used while you are pre being pursued by an enemy. Oh. Infinite healing spot. Very nice. Toilets in the castle are... communal? Guess I'll try holding it in for a while. Are they... Com I, I guess so. There are technically two units there that you could use at the same time. Looks more like a preference thing. Door number two. There's a hidey hole. The door is locked. For reasons. Another decent hiding area. I guess they're just using that changing room for storage. Recovery room is nice, I guess. Hum, but uh. Right, I never really got to explore this next area. I was being chased the entire time. Also, where's my dog? Where's my dog at? No, puppy. Oh, you're going to get a good piece of jerky after this. Stairs, the top of the stairs. Bottom of the stairs. Ah! Motherfucker! Not again. Oh, I just want to explore that area, but he's not going to let me. Just lose track of me. Mm -hmm. I 
Indonesia. God, I am so sorry. Puppy. Yeah, go ahead. Enter my room. And then fizz off. Are we good? Can I explore in peace? Here, pop, 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 pop. Have some jerky. Yum, yum. You're such a good, brave boar for doing that all by yourself. Yes, I would very much like to save after all that bullshit. Oh my god. I don't feel like I've been able to do anything. Oops. It would be nice to refresh up a bit. There's a crack in this mirror, and I can't see anything. No, I, I, don't, I don't need to hide, though. We're, we're fine. We're safe. Another TV. It's a little loud. Landscape painting composed entirely of the color red. Is it of the mansion? It seems quite out of place when compared to the other items in the castle. Uh, I don't think I have anything to do with that, but yeah, no, that is pretty out of place. You're all right. Now what's going on here? Why is this place cordoned off? Can he... can he reach this? Okay, you just... you just wait there. I'll, uh, I'll be back in a sec then. Hmm. Lower the bridge somehow, I can use it across. Also, is he being attacked again?
Hello, Huey. Can you reach that? Yeah, good boy. Another medallion. Still don't know what to do with those. Some ancient castles used to line their walls with gargoyles, as it was believed to ward off bad magic. Perhaps this statue is being used in a similar fashion. What a strange statue. Okay, now maybe I can backtrack a bit and see what the hell was going on over here. Oh, that's a little dangerous. Oh, you got one of those evil clapping monkeys here, I see. Was that doll there before, and was it swinging? I feel like... I feel like, nah. This crest. Why is it slanted like this? Why is it slanted like that? Nothing here. Maybe I could hide. More likely, I'd just get cornered. to the bridge and a bunch of those things uh, maybe I'm reading that wrong maybe that connects somewhere else Various armaments have been placed here. They all look quite dusty, though. <laughs> wow, that's so obvious! The line must have been cut. There is no dial tone. There is nothing out of the ordinary here. Oh, shit. Just came out of nowhere! Oh, I'm so sick of this dude. Just leave me alone for five minutes! Uh. Okay, he gone. But so is my dog. room.
Guess I can go in that hole. Did he see me go under the bed? Mm -mm. Although I've used this place uh, once before. To that hole in the wall. Oh, no, no time for that. Stop! Leave the dog alone! We did this? No, they, they were like that before. Okay, well, I did want to go back this way... ...for something. Hopefully I remember on the way. Safe room over here. I can refill up on uh, health and stamina. Is there anything else down here in this uh, cellar? No. There's a spot to hide. Ideas besides whole. Oi. So that connects to a place I've already been. Uh, I don't think I have any other plates to print right now. Ricardo, it's almost like he's insane or something. Who knows what he will do next? Can't believe the whole balcony just collapsed. This castle must be older than I initially thought. I'd better watch my step from here on out. Like, what... What time period are we supposed to be in that there's electricity around and you, uh... couldn't recognize the plate maker, uh... As, or recognize the plate maker wasn't a computer at the very least. But... Castles like this should still be in fairly decent repair. I guess not decent repair, but like fairly recent and thus not in need of repair. Piano room. Oh. What is this? Oh, wait, no. Yeah, I've, I've seen this already. Um...
Well. I got a visual and audio cue telling me to place it there. Oh, yes, I haven't explored uh, down here very much because I was also being chased. My god. More dog medallion. Now what up with this shit? What's in here? More jerky. Is this where you've been living? I got your doll again. The doll lies on display here. The owner must cherish it. It's sort of like an altar with flypaper flowers, little bear, tin of cookies, skull, fruits, uh, candles, a bunch of creepy pictures, you know, the usual. Let's just forget it. Out of sight, out of mind. Or so they say. There's no way I would even consider lying down here. Yeah, okay, so this is his room then. And the baby room just had oddly large... Uh, objects apart from the crib. An onion! The heck do I use an onion for? Am I gonna be, I gonna be making a bisque? An onion bisque? Lowers dog's stamina. Why? My question is, why? Is there an evil dog I can give it to? Oh yeah, god, there was so much stuff for me to do back here, I forgot. Looks like this is used to open the gate. I don't have my dog here. I don't know what that does yet. I want to keep looking around. Yeah, I want my dog to go look at this. There are beautiful flowers blooming here. I would like them. What's with all the holes in this hallway? This hallway is weird. There's a breeze coming from the other side. I wonder where it leads. Well, and it looks like I can go through it. No, my, my leg just awkwardly clip, clip, clap, uh, clips through walls. No! He's nearby, and he's being bullied. Door is locked from the other side, as usual. Oh, it's the hole, probably. This must lead somewhere. An empty flower vase. But the flower's there. Whenever I managed to actually grab it. Ah! Okay, I can see how that would be a key now. It's another clock. Well, probably shouldn't touch that until uh, the mods are out of the way. 
What is going on with this room? Who would do such a thing? This picture has been ripped out and discarded. I'm no critic, but it doesn't seem that bad. A door? What? It's just a wall made to look like a door. That's stupid. A door? Just another one. Leave the dog alone, my god. There are miniature insect models here, too. More lavender. What type of person would decorate a room with these things? That chandelier is hanging crooked. <laughs> it gives me just a little bit of height. It's an autom anatomically correct model of the human body. It looks so real. Almost as if it's composed of actual body parts. Oh no! You know what? I'm sick of you. Uh, which one is it? Magnesia? Oh god, he missed it. I think. I think he missed it. Oh, is the dog not actually being bullied? Is he just, like, crying out for me? Har har, you can't climb ladders, can you, stupid? No, he can. for a while. And I don't believe I have any reason to either. Shoot. Mm. No, not here. find my dog. I am in need of dog and hole.
God, have I circled around this building enough times? Shoot. That's where this connects. I can get here from there. Darn. All right. I'll find the dog eventually, right? He's, he's got to be here somewhere. Getting viciously bullied. Is he downstairs? I feel like this is where I left him last. Hey, pup. Good boy. Come here. I got a job for you. Coming? Enter hole. Oh, this is not where I thought I would end up. There is something written here. Ferricio Machina. By using a medal by using a medallions, one can actually transform items into new things. The new item is roughly determined by the base item's color compatibility. Album white is mainly used to create objects used by their human creators. Rubrum red is used to compose antimony and magnesia. Nech. Viride green is used in the creation of medallions or other metallic objects. Okay. And viola blue is primarily used to create offerings to animals and beasts alike. Okay. Perpetum Machina. Reacting to the needs of its user, it can produce quantities of antimony powder and magnesia. Whenever one hasn't the means to protect oneself, come here for sanctuary. Aureolus Belly. That was... me mother's name? I think? The book looks almost archaic in nature. Wait, something is written here. Kies. Restores a small amount of Stamina. Mundus. Calms the nerves of those who use it. I wonder what these combinations are supposed to mean. A chest used to store clothes. Yep. Alrighty. Oh my god. A crafting tree of sorts. And it's slot based? What a strange machine. I wonder what they use it for. Randomly rolling items. Weird. Well, I got the medallions, and I don't imagine they serve any other purpose, so. I don't understand. 
This is weird. It seems not very effective. Oh no, where'd my dog go? Where'd you run off to? No, why do I keep losing him? Huey! Good boy. All right, let's get the heck out of here. comes along. Come on. Maybe not. Lovely, lovely jerky. Ah, a way to uh, lower the bridge. Oh no, I need a lever, I think. The clamp is fixed to a wire winding the device. It's rusted solid, but if I hit it with enough force, I may be able to loosen it. Ow. My toe. And down it come. Is this just a way for me to create a passage for the dog? Oh, he's coming for me. How dare you, sir? Uh... Do I just lose stamina? Do I have to worry about, uh, damage? there's any places to hide over here. I don't think so. Oh, I'm gonna run through this whole fucking place again, aren't I? Okay, I need to figure out a way to get the dog 
over to this section of the map so we can help me get those flowers. Maybe it's the gate. Maybe I should just open the gate. Oh, you're finally here? Oh, you're gonna take a while. Okay, dog is in distress, but not necessarily in harm. Unless there's somebody besides... Big boy here. Oh yeah, and I, I still need to try to, uh... Take the keys off of his waist. What the heck, man? Ow! under the piano. No. Is there a good hiding spot in here? No. This dude is getting more and more persistent. Seems like it's not even a matter of how many times I've used this spot, it's how long I've been hiding there, also. Well, I'm here. I guess I can remove any damage he potentially did to me, or it might just be stamina. doing here got the dog here I need to get him over there so if we head back that way I might be able to take him the long way around Now that was that was through here. Yeah, because if I go this way, I can eventually make my way back to that courtyard where the gate was. Ask me as a groom with the key. Ah, yes, and I'm not allowed to go any further that way. 
because the gate's right there. Ugh. Okay. All right. Yeah. Sure. Huey. Hey. Huey. Come here. Huey. Huey, I saw you. Come here. You're a good boy. Now, uh, come over here. Be back. It's for your own protection. All right, now what's the best way to get back over there? Uh, go back upstairs, which is just over there. Doing this right. Yes. He's almost certainly going to get in my way. Good boy. Where the hell did this go? Right. Don't want to go here. Please don't be over by the gate. I'm running out of stamina. Should I go to the gate this way or the other way? I think it's this way. Yes. It's pretty far over here this way. Pull lever. Hey there. Good boy. Thank you for waiting. Now you're in combat mode. What's that about? Go. Come on. Go, Huey. Get the flower, boy. Fresh flowers. These flowers look as if they have literally just been picked out of the ground. Because they were. They are giving off a sweet nectar-like smell. Oh, yeah. Uh, Huey. Come here. Good boy. 
There's a good boy. Got me the flowers. There's a luminescent. Eh. Running away now. Getting away now. Is that with this door? Anything? Yes, locked. On the other side. Go. What you got? Anything going on in there? Not at the very least. I can put these here now. Oh my god, flowers! <laughs> Were they frenzying around in front of the door? I don't know. I can't interact with it. I keep trying to open and close the door instead. Furniture is covered with freshly washed sheets. Huh? There's something in the drain. Another medallion. Fucking useless, because I don't know how the uh, slot machine works in this. So why the hell am I all of a sudden inside of the keel of a ship? <gasps> hey! Go, Huey. Get that object on the ground there that I happened to leave you right beside. <laughs> Study key. Perfect. Small key used to unlock desk drawers. That worked out really well in my favor. And another medallion. Hey, it's a hole. I think. Or just a grate. Okay, well, I guess that's all we had to do here. You can leave now. I'll uh I'll come back the long way, I guess. So I can barricade myself in here. But why? Aha. Uh -huh. Give it up, dude. Can I not hide in one of these? No, he just gave up instead.
give it a few more seconds. Okay. Well, that was a good amount of stuff that we did. Oh, I think we're going to call it there for the night. Whoa. Well, thank you very much for stopping by, all who deemed to pop in. Um, yeah. Haunting Ground, finally getting around to playing it. I have been, um, I've been eyeing this game ever since I played World of Rose, actually. I don't remember, uh, quite how I discovered it. Uh, or I guess rediscovered it, because I do remember watching somebody play through the, like, the first 20 or 30 minutes of this game years and years ago. Um, and I think... When I, yeah, I, th I think when I was looking for uh, games with a similar feel to Roll of Rose, because I really enjoyed the atmosphere and uh, gameplay of that, this obviously came up because, hey, look, another female protagonist who is assisted by a dog in a survival horror game where you're walking around solving puzzles that you would commonly find in a Resident Evil game. Because people design their mansions weird. Oh no. He's crying for me. Oh, you just showed up. Hey, Huey. Hi, boy. Uh, yeah, so I will maybe be back here tomorrow or on Thursday to continue playing through Hunting Ground. Uh, and then once I am done with this, you can go ahead and vote in the poll below on what game you'd like to see me play next. For the rest of October, it's going to be more horror games. Hooray. But yeah, I'm enjoying this very much so far. I'm, I'm looking forward to what else the month has in store for me. So, thank you very much for stopping by. I will see you again next time. Good night.